Hi everyone, Ashley here. Welcome back to my channel. I am going to be doing a first reaction to my new diaper bag. two new diaper bags my baby is 10 months old i previously had like that spark brand or something i don't know i'll link it in the bio honestly the zipper broke on it at around eight months and i've just been coasting through with it and it officially like broke broke it won't even close now so i bought myself not one but two new diaper bags from one of my favorite brands um shea mitchell's Bay's travel brand. I have her suitcase and her like weekender bag as well as some cosmetic bags that I actually have been using for my baby's clothing inside the diaper bag. So I'm a huge fan of her brand. She's also a mom. So she designed these bags to be like, especially for moms and like, I feel like the design of the diaper bags is like really cool just because it has like a ton of pockets, like a little pacifier pouch. Anyways, I bought this bag here as my main diaper bag and it has several pockets on the outside and a ton of pockets on the inside. It also came with a teether toy, a wet pouch, and a pacifier bag. So honestly, way better deal because the other diaper bag that I had, I think was like $100 and didn't come with anything except for a diaper changing pad, which is like not even a good quality one. The one in here is like waterproof, easy to wipe down. The one that I had in the other one is like very soft and like doesn't wipe down easily because it it's like not waterproof. I don't recommend that diaper bag. <laughs> as cute as it is, I think this one's actually way cuter. It looks ginormous sitting next to my head, but honestly, like it's not that bad when you put it on. It like looks like pretty normal. Also, I feel like this one looks really good on my partner too because he wears a lot of like black and gray and I just feel like it's kind of like neutral -y, you know? If you want to see the unboxing of that bag, I'll link a video below for the YouTube short that I did. I didn't make a full video on that one, but I will be doing a what's in my diaper bag video separately for that one if you want to see what's in my diaper bag to get ideas. So my first reaction and unboxing to this one, which I bought this one because it's a fanny pack diaper pack. I go on a lot of walks in my neighborhood and I'm at the point now where it's just like, I don't really need to take that giant diaper bag. In the newborn days, like three to six months as well, I felt like really nervous because I wasn't breastfeeding. And so like, if I didn't have a bottle nearby, like, Sometimes she'd be hungry in two hours, three hours. Now that she's eating solids, I feel very confident to walk in my neighborhood. We have a grocery store, like not even that far away. And so like, if I forget a bottle, which I try not to, if it's around the time, but like, if it's like, I know she's not gonna need a bottle in the next few hours, then I feel confident to like leave the house with like less stuff. Cause then I'm like, well, if she gets hungry, I can hold her off by like getting her a little snack at the grocery store. They have like, you know, little fruit pouches and stuff like that. But I do want to be able to carry like one bottle, one diaper, some wipes. Definitely if I'm getting a snack, like, and I forget the wipes, like not a good look. And also a little pouch to like carry my own belongings in as well. Let's open this. One thing I will say is that um, I don't like how everything came in like bags. Like there was no boxes at all. It was all like plastic bags. I wish that it came in like boxes, like not even the one that they dropped at my door was in a box, but it's all good. It's all good. That's my only complaint. Okay. So here it is. It's like a ginormous fanny pack, I will say. If you look on their website, they have a male model that's holding this and he has it like kind of like shoulder sash style or whatever and like it looks really good on him so i feel like if my partner were to wear this it would probably look a lot better on him but i am a generally smaller person and so it might look a little big on me so honestly not bad and then you could also wear it like this too which might be a preference. Strap is of course adjustable and it also clips. In the back, there is a diaper changing pad. 
very useful. Did not expect that. And this is actually like pretty big. And again, it's like waterproof. So that's cool. Okay, and then I saw in the front, there is supposed to be like, this pocket is like a wipes dispenser. Yeah, so there's like a little hole. And then I guess you put your wipes in from the inside. And then there's also another like mesh like pouch. Here is the inside of the bag. It has like this little wallet thing, which is really convenient instead of bringing your own wallet. So here's the bag, fully extend it. It has the mesh pouch in the front and then you put the wipes in this pouch right there. I guess if you're not using it as a wipe dispenser, you could just use it as like a little pouch. So that's kind of nice too. That's the thing about her brand. She always has like multifunctional things and she always adds this little key leash as well. So you like don't lose your keys in your bag, which is essential. Okay, so that's it for the little fanny pack, diaper pack. I'm really glad I bought this. I feel like it's gonna be super useful on the walks. Love it. Thank you so much for watching my video. I really, really appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up if you like this content and you wanna see more. I am trying to stay consistent now that I kind of have this mom thing down with my 10 month old. I am so excited to be here to share stuff because I know these videos are super helpful for me when I was pregnant and in the early newborn days when I was like, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, thanks again. I'll see you soon.